How's it going, y'all? D and D. I'm coming to you today, probably from one of the lowest mileage 2010 Toyota Rav4 Sport V6s that exists. This car has been in uh, my family since new, since 2010. Uh, it's been driven by a family member uh, locally for the last nine years, and. This is what I talk about by when you take a car and you go from a lease to finance to ownership. Uh, he's had this vehicle now nine years, trouble free, worry free. Uh, the water pump did go on this vehicle, but at that time it was under warranty. So that was replaced by Toyota. And I'll give you a quick overview of some of the interior amenities. In 2010, this is kind of what your Toyota interior looked like. Not much to write home about the door rest, but it's all functional and it stood the test of time in the last nine years. Dashboard has a decent design to it and also, again, has lasted for the last nine years. Radio functions, air conditioning, shifter, mirror controls, cup holders, traction control. Plus, the inside has enough room for five adults and a good trip to Ikea or Home Depot, so... It fits in most parking spots here in the city and it'll fit in most parking garages underneath and so on and so forth. So it's really a great vehicle to have in town if you have a small family and you're looking for an SUV that needs a little bit of power, but at the same time doesn't need to, need to be that big. The combination of the V6 and the size in this vehicle is uh, very unique and very nice. I think the only thing on market right now, new, that's similar in packaging, style, size, and power would be an RDX with the V6 in it. So yeah, that's a quick overview of a 2010 RAV4 uh, V6. Like I said, again, this one has very, very, very low mileage. 25,000 miles translates to 2,500 miles a year, which is probably about three or four miles a day. And that's about right what this car sees, but they hold up. Everything still works. So good luck out there. Happy hunting on a used car. Hope this helps you.